Hello, my friends, and it's been another wonderful day for you, I'm sure. Are you all snuggled in to bed for your bedtime story? Tonight, I'm going to read another fairy story. You know how I love fairies. This is Katie, the candy cane fairy. Are we ready to get started? Uh, here we go. In a gingerbread house on Lantern Lane, decked in red, white, and green, lived a singer, Katie Candy Cane, Fairyland's Christmas Queen. Look, she even has a, a um, crown of candy canes. She's so pretty. With her fairy sisters, Crystal and Glow, she worked throughout the year to perfect their famous festive show and to fill each song with cheer. The secret behind the fairy's fame, the music and sparkle and lights, was extra special candy canes with magical red and white stripes. Do you have magical candy canes at home? But then one winter's morning, Glow noticed something weird. Overnight without warning, the cane stripes had disappeared. Oh no, look, there's no more stripes. The shows were in the planner, the rehearsals were nearly through. But without stripes, to create the glamour, what would the fairies do? Crystal said, if we use our brains, how difficult can it be to put on a show without striped canes? Let's give it a try and see. But with no flashes or fizzles or musical magical stuff and the lack of sparkles and whizzes, it just didn't feel good enough. Oh, those poor fairies. So the fairies jumped onto their motor trike and raced to Holly's cane store. I'm totally out of stripes, Holly said, and I know I can't get any more. I've got canes in gold with sparkly stars or silver with hearts or dots. I've got a few in blue and purple too. Look around, I've got lots. But there's just one thing I have not got and that's without a doubt, is any type of cane with stripes. I'm totally, completely sold out. Well, Katie's poor head was in a spin. Her brain was in a tangle. The fairies had to think again to look at things from a different angle. So they searched their, their house for their stripiest things, their hats, their scarves, and socks. They wore them all together with stripes on their wings and their stripiest party frocks. Are any of you wearing any stripes tonight? Maybe you could help the fairies. But as hard as they tried, things did not improve. Would nothing bring back their sparkling groove? Oh, the poor fairies, what are they going to do? Well, when the day of the Christmas show came around, the fairies had done all they could. But without their canes, they feared it was bound to be boring and not very good. Outside, the audience stood in line. They just couldn't wait to get in. The sisters hugged and said, it's time. Let's take a deep breath <gasps> and begin. Alone on the stage, the fairy sang, softly at first, but then stronger. Slowly they saw the joy they could bring, and they didn't need their canes any longer. There were no fancy sparkles, music, or lights, just fairies singing their parts. Oh, but there was something special that winter's night, the magic that came from their hearts. As they finished the show, the, uh, the audience cheered, it had been a wonderful night. The fairies bowed and stepped outside and were met with a magical sight. Candy cane stripes hung shining and bright like ribbons from every tree. They filled the sky with twinkling lights 
as far as the eyes could see. Katie could barely believe it. Then from behind the Christmas um, tree, Judy, the garland fairy, cried out, I'm sorry, it's because of me. I wanted the trees to be beautiful and sparkling like your show. So I took your stripes without asking. I've caused such trouble, I know. What you did was wrong, said Katie. But you did try to do a good thing. And tonight we've learned we don't need our canes. True sparkle comes from within. Well, Judy joined her friends in one last song, and it started to gently snow. The fairies gathered and sang along. It was the best ever Christmas show. Oh, I hope you like that story of Katie the Candy Cane Fairy. Now remember, boys and girls, when you go to sleep tonight and you wake up tomorrow, make sure you always show your sparkle, the sparkle that's in your heart. Have a wonderful evening and sleep well, my friends. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.